The late adopter. Hi guys, how you doing? Welcome back to the channel. Cardano update right now. Plus four. No, sorry, 5.44% in green today. Looking good, looking nice. But you know, you have to be in green after uh, the yesterday's red candle over here. So that's what we're gonna talk about. We also had live stream yesterday. We were watching it live. This can go all the way above this resistance up here, uh, where technically it was support. Uh, it was crawling back above the support, uh, and then uh, after the stream, probably it went down. So we're gonna talk about that. That's it. Uh, let's get in the charts. Make my face smaller, charts bigger as well. Always, always a good thing, cannot be a bad thing. And see what's actually happening with uh, Cardano right now. Uh, so, <clears throat> three days ago, we became super bullish on Cardano. I did not actually think that uh, we can get above this resistance up here that fast. I don't. I didn't think we, uh, we we would break the resistance that fast, but we actually did break it, and we all went all the way up to 189, up all all the way up here, and. Uh, I thought that was gonna hold it. I thought that was super bullish signal for Cardano. I thought it was bullish signal for entire crypto space. Unfortunately, yesterday uh, Bitcoin decided to pull a little bit back down. So Bitcoin pulls down a couple of percent. Everything else falls down 20% normal market volatility uh, and uh, we were watching this we were watching this and i was saying how perfect how good and how bullish cardano is actually is uh, during the pull pullback because you can see here that yesterday when we had this dump the the wick of the cardano went all the way down to the exactly to to 10 moving average that's the white line here the 10 moving average and then bounced off of a 10 moving average and as soon as it got here it started getting bought back up again up again up again it was all the way up and it was sitting up here when we closed the stream, I think. Uh, and it was super bullish. It was super bullish. And I was telling people how this is going to be fine and everything. Unfortunately, during the day, we fell uh, below and uh, closed below inside this uh, rising wedge. So we are inside. For you guys that are, uh, don't know what this is, this is a rising wedge that we have been into uh, for a long time. Uh, let me just quickly uh, draw it here just so you can see it nicely. Let's go... The, the, that's the uh, rising wedge. This over here was the dump that uh, Bitcoin dropped down to 46,000 and we crawled back up again. We are sitting here below this uh, wedge and then we went into it and uh, zigzagged a little bit before we actually got out of it. Now we are back into it and now again back out of the wedge again. So basically we are trying to stay uh, on the upside of the wedge and then continue up to the higher targets, right? Uh, <clears throat> and you can see even though we fell back inside the wedge yesterday we are trying today to get out of the wedge and that's a very bullish sign so uh, right now we are above technically technically speaking we are bullish uh, we are above all the moving averages on the daily chart uh, we just crawled back all above all the uh, uh, moving averages on the weekly uh, on the four hourly chart as well uh, this is a four hourly chart uh, let me do it like this. This is a four hourly chart and we are above all the moving averages. These are moving averages. This is 10, 20, 50, 100, uh, 200 moving average and we are above all the moving average. You can see here even this dump here yesterday uh, went all, only down to the 50 moving average on the four hourly chart and right now we have uh, got ourselves above all the moving averages again. On the four hourly I'm expecting yeah we are soon to be uh, sitting above all the moving averages uh, on the one hourly chart as well. But the four hourly and the daily we are above all the moving averages. So technically speaking technically speaking yeah we are bullish we are in a strong uptrend because that's actually the definition of uptrend when you're above all the moving averages and the more uh, more time frames you are up above the more bullish you are we are up ab above the all moving average on four hourly not quite on the uh, on the one hourly and uh, the 30 minutes i think we might actually be actually technically right now if you see this candle over here we are above all the moving averages on the one hourly chart as well let's see 30 minutes above all the moving averages five minutes uh, and right now we just got ab exactly above the moving average. So technically speaking, we are above all the moving averages on all time frames, and you cannot be bearish when you are doing that. You cannot be bearish when you are doing that. So this looks good. Uh, we are trying to get back above the on the daily chart above this rising wedge. So that's the actually plan for today. Uh, just get above the rising wedge and keep up there. Where we're gonna do that or not, it depends. So right now we've seen that uh, the the uh, the uh, the four hourly and all other time frames are looking good and dandy, and there is actually no problem. Uh, let's see over here. Here we have something called uh, hidden bullish divergence. So basically, what's happening over here? Let me just 
just turn off the moving averages for a second and clean up a little so I can explain this to you better. Hidden bullish divergence means that the price is going up. So this price over here all closed down. We are looking for closing prices, not the weeks. Uh, the price is go uh, going up, right? The price is going up from this bottom to this bottom. But uh, this uh, bottom and this bottom, the RSI, this is our RSI indicator, it's going down. And that's called hidden bullish divergence. And that's why probably the right now the... Uh, Cardano is pumping because we have a hidden bullish divergence on the 4 hourly time frame which is quite high time frame beside the daily it's uh, one of the most popular time frames after the daily time frame uh, and uh, right now we have this hidden bullish divergence of going over here price going out and the RSI going down that means that we have had some kind of bottoming down here, here and right now the price can actually um, continue moving out so if this holds then this might actually look very good for Cardano and Cardano might actually have a very nice day uh, so I'm quite bullish on Cardano. I'm telling you, we are done with being a stable coin. We are going higher, especially above this all-time high over here. We are above all that again. Uh, what's happening now? It's uh, it, it just recovering from the dump yesterday. Uh, we we fell through a little bit. We tried to get it back above it. I I won't be surprised if we get uh, tomorrow a small red candle here on uh, above the uh, above the. Oh, rising wedge above this uh, like just to test the support and then continue uh, continue up but all in all super bullish on cardano i don't see anything wrong wrong with it now of course we can always fall down uh if bitcoin decides because i told you in the start that bitcoin is kind of undecisive i don't know if i told you in this video or not but if bitcoin decides to go down it's gonna be something like yesterday everything's gonna go down but what i'm expecting then as well i'm expecting a quick pull down and then just uh, turning around and just going straight up to the sky because there, there, there is no reason why we should be going down you can see that all of these weeks one two three four or oh, last four days all of these weeks just got bought back up in as soon as we hit this 152 line you can see it here very nicely 152 as soon as we hit 152 as soon as we get there people start buying and buying it all the way up to one or about 162 uh you know because be people are bullish people have said this is the lowest i'm gonna let it go and they're just buying as soon as the price starts uh, getting that low that said super bullish on cardano no problem stop by tomorrow guys we're gonna do an update on cardano as well and check out the links below to the patreon and telegram group patreon if you need some help picking coins we got to do some kind of daily outcomes video there and and on the on the telegram we got like uh, three and three point six thousand people right now uh, chatting away panicking about everything because uh, you know they want 20 percent gains that said again subscribe to the channel like the video and all the shebang thanks for watching guys appreciate it see you around bye bye